Well, we, wow, what a difference 24 hours makes. Good evening, everybody. It is Tuesday night here on the Rancho, and I just happened, you know, I rarely look back at videos that I put up, much less ones that I put up yesterday or the day before, and something happened to come up in my feed, and it's called Surgery is Over, I Feel Like Charles Bronson. I'm looking at this video I put up yesterday. I'm like, holy, look at that. <laughs> I mean, anybody that's looking at that video from yesterday is thinking, Rosie, I hope you had your lawyer on speed dial when you got it out. I mean, it looks like I really do look like Charles Bronson when I came out of that uh, surgery. But you know, guys, it is what it is. I had all that injection. Now look at my uh, look at all oh, my, my face is starting to come good. It's got another week or so till it calms down. But holy smokes! Hey, listen, I've had so many people wrote me over the last twelve hours. How you doing? How's everything going? We're worried about you. We saw the video yesterday. Something that it doesn't look right. This doesn't look right. That doesn't look right. Are you sure this is good? I'm sure everything is all good and it's right on track. You know, the worst part of it is I can't take a shower probably until tomorrow afternoon. And that's going to put me a full 48, 50 hours yuck, of uh, misery. That's the worst part of everything. You know, that worst part is just that, uh, you know, it's like if, imagine if somebody took like a, a box grater on the rough and they just uh, grated your sides and your back with that. You imagine how, you can imagine how inflamed you would feel on that, that, oh, it just feels so raw. That's the only real pain that I have uh, right now. That's the only thing I could get comfortably over the top, my little wife beater here. But I did want to give you the update that I'm doing well. Missy Jen is taking great care of me. I like to feel like the worst is over. I don't want to push myself too much. I know I was an idiot yesterday. I got the ladder out. I'm cleaning out. Getting ready to clean out the gutters. You know, we got a block gutter. Missy Jen's like, the hell with that. You know, you're going to get to bed. So I'm going to have an early... Uh, probably an early night tonight, but I did want to update and give you guys the news that, you know, the chipper Rosie's back. I did have a little bit of a meltdown about two hours ago. Um, you know, I don't know, sometimes the weather, it's just, it's just raining day after day, and I can't find stuff. You know, my phone's not charged, and it just seems like every little thing is so irritating because the pain... The pain is just uh, so terrific, but it's amazing what an oxy does, you know, and how it just boosts my spirits up. Anyway, I wanted to tell everybody that it did take the time to uh, write that uh, 24 hours later, I'm feeling, feeling pretty good, and I'm feeling on the way to uh, victory. I do have a checkup tomorrow afternoon, my initial one. I'm hoping some of this bandaging is going to be taken off. I am all balked up here. I got the monkey suit on. I got to wear this compression uh, garment. So we'll see what happens with the doctor uh, tomorrow. Sleeping is problematic. Okay, I ain't going to lie to you, right? Can't sleep on this side. It's like you took the you took the grater. Can't sleep on this side. You took the grater over. Can't sleep on your back. Uh, that's where they filled your butt in. You don't want to smash your butt down that you just have, uh, had filled in. Why don't you sleep on your stomach, right? With these massive orbs, I'm going to sleep on my stomach, right? So I guess I'll just end up sleeping on my head. Anyway, guys, see you tomorrow. Thanks so much for your concern. Love you guys. I'm doing great.